President Felix Tisikedi of the Democratic Republic of the Congo DRC made a bold statement during a joint press conference with French President Emmanuel Macron in Kinshasa, highlighting the need for a respectful and equitable relationship between Africa and the West. The tension arose as President Chisikedi emphasized the importance of abandoning paternalistic attitudes and outdated colonial legacies in Franco-African relations, look at us differently by respecting U.S., by considering us as true partners and not always with a paternalistic look with the idea of always knowing what is necessary for us, President Chisikedi asserted, directing his remarks towards President Macron. He further declared the end of the era of Franco-Afrique a term symbolizing French interference in African affairs and called for a policy of equality between the two nations. President Chisekedi's remarks were a poignant reminder of the need for mutual respect and partnership in international relations. President Macron's new policy strategy for Africa, announced during his tour of several African nations, signaled a shift away from traditional French military presence on the continent. Instead, France proposed establishing academies to train security units of host countries, aiming to reduce its military footprint while promoting security cooperation. However, skepticism remained regarding France's true intentions in Africa. With some critics questioning the sincerity of Macron's policy reforms. The legacy of Franco-Afrique and historical grievances continued to cast a shadow over Franco-African relations, highlighting the complexities of post-colonial dynamics. President Chisikedi's call for France to impose sanctions on Rwanda for its alleged involvement in the ongoing conflict in the DRC's Goma area further underscored the challenges of regional stability and security. The DRC leader's demand for accountability and justice resonated with many, reflecting the urgency of addressing the root causes of violence and instability in the region, while Macron's visit to Africa aimed to reshape France's image and promote partnership based on equality. Lingering tensions and unresolved issues from the past posed significant obstacles to achieving genuine reconciliation and cooperation. The path forward required a sincere commitment to dialogue, transparency, and mutual understanding between all parties involved. In conclusion, President Chisikedi's reminder to President Macron to respect Africans and abandon paternalistic attitudes served as a wake-up call for a new era of relations between Africa and the West. It highlighted the importance of mutual respect, equality, and accountability in building sustainable partnerships and fostering peace and prosperity in the region.